breaking news of Canelo Alvarez confirming and announcing the Bivol rematch in May, where he stated, quote, look for revenge, end of the quote. On the other hand, Bivol should be looking forward to getting drug tested by Vada for at least 15 weeks, the full duration of time. If I was Bivol, that would be one of my main requirements as we don't want anybody eating contaminated meat around. Nevertheless, none of that really matters because the skill gap between the two is so far apart. They have completely different understanding of boxing. Canelo Alvarez is at least 100 years behind. That's why the rematch is going to be worse for Canelo. Nine times out of 10 or at least 19 times out of 20. The rematch always benefits the more intelligent fighter, the more skillful fighter the fighter with the higher IQ, which that would be Bivol. A pure example of that is Devin Haney versus Combosis rematch. And you could expect Bivol to do the same thing to Canelo. Matter of fact, the judges are more of a threat to Bivol than Canelo. As we all saw last time how Bivol beat Canelo Alvarez every single minute of every single round. And all of the three judges some way somehow only had Bivol winning by one point. What a disgrace to boxing. Them judges should have been fired on the spot immediately. However, that's what's going to make the rematch worse for Canelo because now Bivol may stop Canelo with that in mind. So we'll see if Canelo is a man of his word at the moment in time. Canelo really has no easy option as the walls are closing in on Canelo. The WBC has ordered Canelo to fight the winner of Benavidez versus Caleb Plant, which that's most likely going to be Benavidez. The Mexican monster Canelo Alvarez has been avoiding. That's one option. The second option is Bivol rematch. It went from bad to worse for Canelo. With the facts being laid out, drop your thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe below and click on the notification bell to be continued on the next episode of Aachi. Aki, Ak TV, peace. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.